Hey guys, this is Danny's Auto Repair. Today I'm going to be doing a quick review on my uh, Husky rolling tool bag. I bought this bag about, say about a year ago at uh, Home Depot. And I paid about, I think it was like 60 bucks for it. And uh, it's been very good, guys. As you can see here, it has uh, lots of pockets. I mean, you can put just about anything in here. All kind of tools. Plumbing tools, electrical tools, whatever, you know, whatever your, your profession is, the tools will fit in here, guys. Gloves, electrical stuff, anything, you name it. Even auto, auto tools also. As you can see here, I still have a few a few uh, tools in here left because um, all the other stuff over there is already too much I have. So I still have a couple of things in here. So as you can see, guys, this has a lot of space in here. Lots of space. It also has more pockets in here. <clears throat> you guys can see I have lots of stuff in here and it all fits good I just want to take some of this stuff out so I can show you guys the inside and how much more space you have in here have a Milwaukee charger all the stuff fits in here batteries stapler gun polishing pad spatula hammer uh, more gloves uh, c-clamp okay so this is the inside guys it's pretty much empty now oh I still have a crowbar uh, pry bar I mean in here also so you can see guys this is the inside it has all these extra pockets about six pockets here and then you have another pocket on this side and that's about it so you got seven pockets in the inside let me see what the hell is this because I'm not even sure what is this I never used this before I barely used this uh, bag just only to put my stuff in here, but that's about it. I never, you know, used it for anything else. I guess it has a zipper in here. Let me see. I think this opens up, guys. You see? It has like a Velcro thing. I'm not sure what this is for, but this looks like a zipper. Now, I don't know if this opens up or not. But this is a Velcro thing here. I'm trying to see if this opens or not. I don't know, guys. It's not coming out. So I don't know if it's, if this opens or not. But it looks like it. Anyway. So, like I said, you got... You got six pockets in the inside. And an extra one here on the side is seven. I use this for batteries. Um, in the front here, you have this big one in the middle. And you have one, two, two on this side. And on the side here, you have three. One, two three three more pockets and I guess when you turn it this way there's three more it's just a lot of pockets guys for 
all your tools or whatever whatever you need and then on the back here is the wheels very good wheels nice strong wheels guys see this thing is almost new I barely use this but I bought it when I first started buying tools but it's almost brand new as you can see it's very clean very good condition guys so back here there's no well there's a little sleeve thing here so you can put I guess your name badge or whatever and um, it has another thing here maybe you can fit a hammer in here and another one on this side or a screwdriver or something and and this goes up and down guys see you can it's like a little luggage you see you can take it anywhere this is very nice guys very nice tool bag they got them at Home Depot guys I'm not sure if they got them at Lowe's but Home Depot's Home Depot definitely has them so it's very nice it comes in handy you can put all your stuff in there because I'm pretty sure it's gonna fit because look all the stuff I got out of there and that's nothing I had a lot more stuff in there a lot more that's only a few things I took out I've had a lot of stuff that I have over there in this bag and it all fit so it's a very very good bag very very good guys and for the price it wasn't bad at all sixty dollars all right so I suggest if you guys are in the market for a tool bag this is it guys right here the husky I'm not sure the name of it but it's like a rolling tool bag because it has the wheels and the wheels are very strong so you don't have to worry about the wheels are going to be breaking or anything like that and this and this tool bag will last a long time believe me it's very durable and uh, it's very strong guys as you can see here the stitching it's very well made very well made you can just carry this also through the handles you don't even have to use that this thing here to to drag it you can just carry it if you want I mean that's if you don't have anything heavy in there oh and it also has these things these little bungee cord things but all in all very very strong Very strong, durable, very nicely made. And this by Husky. So, there it is, guys. Husky rolling tool bag. Very good. So, let me put all this back in here so you can see. That it all fits in here just the way it came out. Very good bag. Like I said, guys, I had a, a lot more stuff in here. This was like filled up to the top with tools, but since I got that other that other big box over there, I um 
I had to make more room because it it couldn't fit in here. So I had too many too many tools. So I had to get another box. So as you can see, everything that was in here, I put it right back in, and it fit very nice. And as you can see, I still got a lot of space left. And I can also uh, close it up. Oh, I forgot to mention, this has a zipper up here also. Right here. You can close the whole bag with the zipper. I guess to close it, you put it like this. Just like that. Then you close the zipper. Just like that, guys. Nice little bag. Well, it's not that little. It looks pretty big. So there you have it, guys. So I hope this can help somebody out in deciding, you know, what tool bag to buy. And uh, I recommend this to anybody. It's a very good tool bag, guys. So... Like, share, subscribe. God bless and have a great day.